I love Boxing Day. I love where it sits on the calendar and everything it represents. Holidays and laughter, family and friends, how the eyes of a nation full of scallywags and sports nuts all end up here at the MCG, focusing on the national institution that is the Boxing Day Test. This is not simply a game of cricket, it's bigger than that. It's a celebration of who we are, a bringing together of Australians, from people who live for our national game to those who wouldn't know a googly from a goat. Sport, like everything, is nothing without history, without the romance of being able to walk back in time. To remember my old mate Bill Laurie, outscoring the Windies' first innings total, all on his own, here in the summer of 68. Like a rock alongside him, even back then, Ciappelli, with a knock of 165. DK Lilly, bowling Viv, the master blaster. Last ball of the day, 1981. Just a year later, in what history records as the greatest ever Boxing Day test, Alan Border and Tomo fighting to the death. Ian Botham, the executioner on day five. Australia just three runs short of the most improbable of victories. 93-94, a tubby kid from Wagga making 170 runs over four rain-interrupted days. And the following Boxing Day test, my first as captain, beating the Poms. How we'll never forget Warnie's hat-trick on the last day. That's the beautiful thing about getting to sit in this commentary box. The Boxing Days, they just keep rolling on, right before our eyes. Got it! I'll tell you what it is, it's a ripper, a beauty, bonza, a bottler, all at the very same time. Welcome to the MCG and the 2012 Boxing Day Test, Australia versus Sri Lanka, right here on Nine's Wide World of Sports.